Hey guys, Christmas is coming up real fast and you definitely need these gift ideas. So it is November and Christmas is just around the corner, literally like in a month or so, maybe even a little bit less. I know, maybe not around the corner, but it's coming quick. So I know recently I've been stocking up on Christmas gifts early, that way I'm ready to go by the time Christmas comes around and because of that I figured maybe I should share these gift ideas with you all. So the first thing on this list is definitely a disposable camera. A lot of people like the vibes of these pictures and they're just super quick and easy. You can probably find them at Walgreens, AGB. Amazon literally anywhere the next thing is a name necklace these chokers are super cute I definitely want one myself it can either be their name the partner's name literally anything so a little bit on the pricier side are definitely airpods it can be any other type of headphones but I know airpods are really trendy right now and a lot of people love them so the next big one is definitely clothing you can either go and shop in store or shop online I know Princess Polly is really popular a lot of youtubers have recently released new merch so there's that artist merch literally Really any type of clothing. To hop off of fashion and kind of beauty, the next thing that is on this list is definitely makeup. Shane Dawson once again released a conspiracy palette. I think they're going to restock if not already. Um, it's probably sold out again. So in terms of skincare, I know face toner is a really big popular thing. Um, there's also setting spray like Mario Badescu. They kind of like go together hand in hand. Next are backpacks. Whether or not they're mini backpacks, full size backpacks. I know um, the Kankin backpacks are really popular for a long time. I do own one myself. Those I think are still super trendy for different aesthetics so definitely backpacks. If not a backpack you can find different types of handbags like side bags, regular purses. I know those are just a really convenient thing to have. The next item on this list is for my YouTubers out there or photographers. Definitely tripods. Tripods are a really big thing to get for Christmas just because depending on your budget they can be very expensive but you can also find good ones for inexpensive. Money. Money is a really good gift if you are confused as to what to buy this person so whether or not it is $10 to $50 just any amount of money would be good so an item I know I'm always super happy to receive is definitely a blanket so I did receive a blanket I think a couple years ago with um, the, my meet and greet picture with Sean Mendes on it it was so funny my mom got it for me so any type of blankets they're good for many reasons and yeah. So next on this list is definitely phone cases. I know Casetify is super popular right now, has such, such cute cases. There's also many other ones I can't think of any right now. I'm having like a brain blank, but just any kind of phone cases. I know that's something I love to buy on my own, so if someone bought it for me for Christmas, I'd be super grateful for that. So if this person you're buying gifts for is a music lover, vinyls are definitely the way to go, whether it's vinyls or CDs, just any type of music. Um, I know a lot of people go electronic now, but some of these things you have to pay for, so I don't know if you can get Spotify gift cards or how that works. Movies. So movies are a super, super good thing to just have in your everyday life. I love receiving movies. Perfume. If this person likes to smell good, you can get perfume or cologne. I know I have a ton of perfumes, even though I wear like the same three all the time. Shoes. Shoes are so popular right now. It's like a staple with every outfit, whether they're Air Force or Nike Air Force or Vans, any kind of shoes shoes are the best way to go. So this one's super expensive and not something I would really expect anyone to get anyone else, but I had to put it on this list because you guys mentioned it on Instagram, a MacBook or any other type of laptop. Any kind of laptops, electronics are really good to receive if you have the budget for it. Journals. So if you are someone who likes to plan or you know someone who likes to plan, journals are a good way to go because it's just a good organization thing while being super cute because some journals are really, really cute and nice. Before we continue with this video, make sure you subscribe real quick down below and give this video a thumbs up if you're enjoying. This gift is going to be really popular with those Visco girls out there, shell necklaces or chokers. They're actually super cute. I've never owned one personally. Show necklaces. Those are really popular right now. You can probably find some for really inexpensive on like Shein or Romway. A subscription. So I know there's a ton of subscription boxes out there where you could probably buy their first month, first two months, and then if they like it, they can keep going. If your person is interested in learning music, a ukulele is a way to go. It is probably one of the easiest string instruments to learn. Not that it is easy, but compared to guitar or bass guitar, gift cards. Gift cards go along with money. Like I said earlier, it's a last minute gift. Whether or not you get one of the Visa gift cards where it's basically usable anywhere or a specific one to like Home Depot, Amazon, Princess Polly, Brandy Melville, PacSun, concert tickets. So concert tickets are really good if you're 
person you're buying gifts for is like me and likes the experience of seeing their artists live and just it's a whole thing concert tickets are never gonna be a fail another one for my youtubers out there is any type of microphone I did list a road microphone because that's personally what I want I found one on Amazon I think for like $50, $60, I don't know. This one's never gonna fail. Candy or food, any type of that is so good. One time I asked my sister for a box of Nerd Ropes. Best gift ever. Pop figures. Not a lot of people really collect them anymore, or at least not that I've seen, but for my boyfriend and I, it's tradition to buy him a pop figure every single year. Hair accessories. I know I recently got really into hair bands, so buying some of those or buying any type of hair accessories, specifically scrunchies actually, will fly really well with whoever you're buying these gifts for. Nail polish is another accessory that I am always grateful to receive on Christmas. It's super easy. You can buy like gift sets that come with several shades and just wrap it up like that. So with the permission of a parent or the person themselves or if you know that they're already shopping for this, get them a pet or stuff for them to get that pet. But just make sure it's not an impulse buy and they wanted it or you did. I don't know. Just make sure someone's going to care for that animal properly. Watch bands. I know Apple watches are super, super popular right now. I had a Fitbit until it broke, but typically the wristbands are interchangeable and you can find some on Amazon that are super, super cute. So I would recommend buying them some of those if theirs is messing up or you know they just want a different one. So the next item is something that's personally on my list is reusable produce bags. Um, depending on whether or not this person is one that wants to be economically friendly, you can find these on Amazon in packs of nine for like six dollars, eight dollars, nine dollars. Just anything reusable which leads me into my next one which is reusable straws so next on this list it goes with phone accessories which is a pop socket I know I received a pop socket one year super grateful for it unfortunately it broke so something that's a staple on many people's list is fuzzy socks fuzzy socks are good year-round literally the best thing ever to receive and super inexpensive so if you are getting a gift for a fashionista belts are probably going to be a good way to go because belts are things that can dress up your outfits like tremendously so the last thing on this list is something that I personally want and I'll go ahead and link it down below as well as everything else that I mentioned on this list is a Amazon I, I don't know if it's by Amazon but it's like a Bluetooth camera button I guess so it'll like connect to your phone via Bluetooth and you can set your phone up somewhere and you just click the button and it'll go ahead and take pictures that way you don't have to hold your phone the whole time like this and like try to take pictures you can just set it up use that camera if you have a tripod and then click the button it'll go ahead and take your Instagram pictures for you so that's a super good thing if you just like to I don't know have an Instagram if you blog if you're a photographer it's just a cool thing to have so I hope you guys enjoyed this gift guide I hope it helped you in some way shape or form if you have other gift ideas that I didn't mention make sure to leave them down below anyway follow me on all my social media so I'll be linked down below as well as almost everything I talked about in this video and I will see you guys in the next one bye